Hello YouTube. So in this video I'm going to be reviewing the mini Dianchang 3x3 cube. So there are a few different versions. So this is the uh, version that I'm pretty sure it's a, a bit larger than the other version. And this one has stickers on it. So I got this cube from E3 Cubes Canada. And it didn't cost me much. On the site it's about... 275 and the shipping to here was a bit more than a dollar so it's about four dollars cost me in total so that's a really good deal for a, a cube like this so um it took about a week and a half to ship which is also good um so i'm going to start off with the sticker quality so the stickers are pretty good well, the colors are easy to differentiate. So, checkerboard. Well, the red and orange are a bit confusing, but they're pretty good. And this is obvious, and this is good too. Um, now, just the quality. Um, when I got it, there was like a little air bubble in the sticker, and it, it's annoying because it, sometimes it's trying to kind of get off. Um, now the uh, quality, the turning quality and stuff. So out of the box, it was horrible. But as soon as I put a bit of lube in it, it became a very fast. Oops. Oh yeah, and you can see here the air bubble that I was talking about, and it's really annoying. Um. So yes, it turns very well. Um. However, you can. Here the spring like yeah that's a bit annoying to prevent that you can just lube the core but anyways um so turning quality is very good corner cutting is pretty good too especially considering it's a mini cube okay can't quite do that but I can do at least this yes easily so yeah it does a lot there's about a piece Pretty nice uh, considering it's a small cube. Um, it does not reverse corner cut um, at all. So, unfortunately. Um, it does lock up a fair bit. Yeah. Um, pops. It sometimes pops. But, oh wait, it's fine. Um, I'm actually not sure if you can tension it. Just... Okay, so I just took off the cap with a butter knife, and yes, there's a screw, so uh, yes, you can tension it. So if you don't like the tension, too, too tight or too loose, you can just change it. Um, they are pretty hard to get off, though, the caps. Um, now, after I've um, finished the quality, so I think I'm going to show you the pieces, what they look like. So, this is what a corner looks like. Uh, standard pieces edge core oh something I forgot to show you about though is the size comparison um, how big it is compared to a normal cube so this is a uh, Zanchi so you can see it's how much smaller it is So yeah, um, I'm not sure exactly how much it is, like how much it measures, but if you give me a second, I can measure it. So it is, so it's four and a half centimeters. So this is the four and a half centimeter version. I'm not sure what the size of the other one is, but this is the four and a half. Now to uh, show you how how well it is, I'm gonna do a few solves on it. How I am used to uh, black cubes and a white side. This is a white cube with a black side, so it's gonna confuse me a bit. Um, however, I've already done a bit of time solves on it, and I got a 13. Point, I don't remember what average is five. So it's 
scrambled. Okay. Okay, that was a 20, but it's kind of hard to solve looking through the viewfinder. Well, the screen on the camera. So I'm going to do another solve. Okay, so that was a 15. So it's so you can see the key was pretty good. It didn't lock up much on that, but well, yeah. So uh, I think that's it for the review. Thanks for watching.